Okay, guys, welcome back to the channel. Got a very cool video today. I've been going with the guys from 3MA Audio to some of their home installs with people that are buying new systems and filming as they set up the system. And it's fun for me. I love the content I can get and share with you guys. Uh, and it's really ear opening a lot of times. Obviously, some of these systems are just ridiculous. I have a video of an MBL Extreme home install. I'll be sharing that at some point, but you've already seen the Extremes a lot on my channel and even the install at 3MA. So I thought I'd figure feature some other ones right now. And one today is in particular one I wanted to share for a few reasons, but upcoming, before I get to that, will be a really major install of a guy that's putting three systems in in Las Vegas. Uh, later in this month, I'm going to the home entertainment show and then jetting over to Vegas where I'll meet the guys from 3MA and film that installation. So you definitely want to pay attention to that one upcoming. But back to the topic at hand was a system that kind of surprised me. I mean, I know how great Sonus Faber gear is, Macintosh gear, acoustic signature turntables and all that are. But this particular system still surprised me in terms of, I don't think I can ever remember sitting down and listening to a system that was just so smooth. And it really just, the words that came to my mind were buttery, liquid, smooth. You know, if I was looking at a restaurant menu, like this was foie gras. You know, it wasn't like smooth and cheesy in a bad way it was like the foie gras of smooth and uh you know buttery and rich these words just came to my mind and you know it's hard to use these terms sometimes to translate to actual uh audiophile measurements and objective terms but i think you get the impression when i use those terms what we're talking about here and what's great about this particular system is I didn't see it coming. I mean, I know Sonos Faber is a very smooth sounding speaker, great uh, designs, and Macintosh, pre pretty neutral, but this is a hybrid amp from uh, Macintosh, their MA15000. It'll be in the video excerpt I put next, all the model numbers. But this hybrid was really interesting in terms of how it mated with the Sonos Faber. It just presented a very liquid, smooth sound. And if you really look at Macintosh, it's interesting with their products, with the one that has the two built-in amplifiers, the, the uh, solid state, two channel, and then the tube section. It's almost implying that their tube section is what they like, or at least recommend for the highs and mid-range, and then the solid state section for the bass. Well, to that same end, I think that this hybrid that they came up with is delivering the goods in a, in a similar way and made it just great with the Sonus Faber speakers. It was just so smooth. And obviously some people may not like it super smooth. They like different tastes. So this, you know, depending on your taste, this may or may not be the perfect system for you. But I would encourage you to maybe consider this because so many audiophiles get ear fatigue or they just only can listen to certain recordings because it may be too fatiguing, too detailed, too much of a window on the performance. Um, that may not be what they like uh, long term or for whatever reason of their taste. And what was great about this guy is I actually was in 3MA the day that he came in a few months ago first to audition and bought these. It's just taken a while for the stuff to come in. And he is really a returning audiophile from 20, 30 years ago. He came from using some old mission speakers from it had to be back in the 1980s he showed me and i'll put up some pictures of them and then this is what he graduated to going from these old vintage mission speakers and uh, i think it was a yamaha receiver or something to this system was a huge delta increase and the other cool thing uh doing the install although it probably won't be on much of the videos that his family his wife was actively involved with this system and enjoying it and participating with it, which made it all the more of a great fit with the smoothness of the sound, the ability to just listen to it for hours without fatigue and just enjoy the music no matter what type of recording or quality. So anyway, I'm going to turn it over to Luis. We're going to walk through the specific items and then I'll break the video up into a second video where I put all the tracks 
that we recorded and let you listen to them th at those at your leisure. So hope you enjoy. Okay, Luis, what do we have here? Another 3MA customer's home. This one's yes. an awesome system. So this beautiful system um, is uh, at the center of the system. We have the Sonos Faber Amadi Tradition. Those are wonderful speakers. Finishing on them is amazing. The front actually has leather, um, very Italian design, silk dome tweeter, very smooth, sweet sounding speaker. And uh, powering those speakers, we have the Macintosh integrated. It's a hybrid, so the front stage, input stage on this amp is a uh, tube. It's a tube front stage and uh, the back end is solid state. So it's a 300 watt solid state amp. It's the MA12000. It has a phono, it has a DAC, and we have an Arender streamer running into the DAC of the unit. Um, it's an N10, has four terabytes of storage, so plenty of files inside of the unit, uh, as well as you can do streaming services with it. And to close it all off, we have the Acoustic Signature Maximus turntable. Um, beautiful German turntable, all billet aluminum finishing. I mean, the, the craftsmanship and the finishing on this turntable is just amazing. Um, so we just also installed um, these audio racks from Ultrasonic, which are two inch thick shelving with two inch thick legs and the really really cool part of it is the gold anodizing so the gold anodizing on these legs really make it pop and just complete the entire system set up here at the bottom pucks are still on order coming yes yeah we have the three inch disc coming coming tomorrow actually cool. so it sounds amazing we'll, we'll play some clips for you and uh you know, hope you keep following us and enjoying all these systems we've been installing. Yeah, it's awesome looking system, but uh, equally impressive sounding. Let's go ahead and listen to a few tunes. <laughs> 